Hey guys, Seed up here, back with another video, and this time we're going to do the differences between The Last of Us Episode 2. We did Episode 1, so now we're into Episode 2. Let's go ahead and get into this. The beginning of the episode starts off with a flashback, and of course that does not happen in the game. They're not doing any of those flashbacks, so that big 10-15 minute part does not happen. Something else that does not happen is that the military is heavily after Joel, Tess, and Ellie. They're really going after them in the show. That's not like that. They just escaped, which I believe i talked about in my last video but if not saying it again like the military is after them in the game here they are not they're not running from anyone they're just escaping i really feel like that was a big thing they left out in the show and they should have put that in there because in the game you see and you feel more of the tension as they're escaping through the sewers and all that and eventually they escape but you don't get that tension in the show Something else that was different was that in the game, they were going through a lot of buildings and the clickers were there. That's not how it is in the show. They come in a little bit later. They're all going through like um, a museum, but in the game, they're going through a lot of destroyed and wreckage buildings and they're climbing over them, trying to get to where they need to be. In the show, it's in the museum where they find the clicker. So a little bit different. Of course, there's a lot of different clickers in the game. There's a lot more than just the one. Also, that little scene where Ellie's ringing the bell and stuff and acting like she's in the hotel, that happens later in the game when Tess is dead. In the show, it happens with Tess, so just a little different note there. Now, the museum part, it does happen in the game. It's just that the soldiers catch up to them, and this is where it's a lot different from the show than the game, because in the museum, that's where all the soldiers are trying to get to them and they're trying to stop them, of course, because they escaped and they're still on the hunt for them. Now, in the show, it's completely different. Like I said, there's no soldiers there. There's, the city is full of infected. So that whole city is just overrun by infected, which there's some in the game, but that's not really the big thing in the game. It's more so that the soldiers, Fedra, they're after them. Now, before Tess makes the sacrifice in the show, she says, get her to Bill and Frank's and she wants Ellie to go to Bill and Frank's and we will get to that in episode three on why she chose that place instead of in the game where she says, take her to Tommy's. So in episode three, we'll see why she says Bill and Frank's in the show. When Tess tries to make the sacrifice in the show, Ellie's trying to stay with her. In the game, it ain't like that. She's not like begging to stay with her or trying to like not leave her. No, no, no. In the game, she goes. She, she leaves. She's just like, I'm sorry, blah, blah, blah. But in the show, she was like, we can't leave her, blah, blah, blah. She wasn't doing that. <laughs> she was not doing that in the game. In the show, she did. She was like, we can't leave her. We can't blah, blah, blah. No, that's not how it is in the game, y'all. And of course, the biggest change being that it's the infected in the show that tries to kill Tess and she blows herself up and that's how she dies. So she goes out in a more heroic way, I guess, in the show because they're able to easily get away in the game. She just tries to take down as many Fedra soldiers that she can because Fedra's after her. And she takes down, I don't know, I don't even know if she took down a lot. Maybe she took down a couple, I don't know. But <laughs> you still have to go and kill Fedra to escape the building and stuff in the game. So those are the differences for episode three. See it about, guys. We will be back for episode three. There's a lot more differences in that one. Um, this one, they had some things that they left out. I didn't like how they left out where they're going through the damaged buildings that would have been hard to do i guess so i see why they left that out and i also did not like how they just let fedra off the hook basically hey, that was it after episode one that's pretty much all we get from fedra <laughs> i didn't really like that either because that's it for them um i wish they would have put them in there chasing them in the show but hey it is what it is see y'all in the next one see you about peace